What's up, everybody? KG here, coming at you with an exciting live stream today. For a moment, we've been waiting on for a long time. Testnet V3 for Pulse Chain and PulseX is here right now. It is live. And if you check the link of this description, you will get all the RPC settings that you need in order to connect to the network. Now, how's everybody doing today? I'm here for any and all questions. We've got a lot of people streaming right now. We've got the Pulse Chain Telegram main chat popping off, which is really exciting to see. We've got the hex price pumping hard. There was a mega green candle after Richard's announcement. So give me just one moment. I'm going to share a video link. So we're just going to be looking around, putzing around, seeing what's going on. What's up, Alsa Mac? What's up, Triple Alliance? Yeah, and for anybody who's curious about this is your first time to Pulse Chain, it, this is the fourth iteration of the Pulse Chain testnet leading up to the mainnet launch, which is going to be a really big event. For those that don't know, all of your tokens that you're holding on Ethereum in the form of an ERC-20, you're going to get a one-to-one -one copy airdrop on Pulse Chain. So you're actually going to be able to check your airdrop to see how it went. I'm not exactly sure when the snapshot was taken, but let's dive in and see what we can find out here. Go and check that price chart real quick to see what we got going. Go ahead and share my screen with you all. Present, share screen. We're going to look at this hex price chart. Somebody was happy with that launch. Look at that thing. This is the cool, this is where I track the hex price. It's just uniswap.vision. So this is where I track the hex price. Everybody has their own little thing, but I like to do it here. And yeah, let's see what's going on. Let's go ahead and head over to, well, first of all, Let's go ahead and verify that this is legitimate. Don't trust me, right? We're verifying for legitimacy here. We're going to go to Richard Hart's tweet, which I will also share for you in the comments. You can verify for yourself. Go ahead here, share this screen. We are on Richard Hart's Twitter, and you can see that PulseChain.com testnet v3 is here. Please use it and prepare for mainnet launch. Warning, this is the final testnet, and mainnet may launch at any time now. And then he gives the links for PulseX to be a validator and for the Block Explorer. Now, if you one cool way to verify the RPC settings that I've shared in the description of this video are legitimate, you can click on the Block Explorer link here. Oh, it's going to make me stop sharing there. Can I just share the screen?
Oh, I can just, there it is. Jeez, thanks. Okay. So here I'm sh sharing the screen. Now, if you scroll down to the bottom of the block explorer, you can see add testnet v3 right here on to MetaMask. Now, this is a setting that will be preloaded into the internet money wallet once in an, in an update that we are pushing shortly. So you'll be able to just download the wallet and right there from the wallet, you'll be able to click Pulse Chain V3, but it takes a little bit of time to propagate these things to the app store. So for now, you click Add Testnet V3 and it's going to pull up your MetaMask right here. Let me go ahead and pull this off the screen real quick. And you'll see that the RPC settings match what I put there in the description. But what I just showed you is how to verify for yourself. And please don't go out there falling for scams. Hey, here's the settings. People can give you fake settings. Be very, very careful out there. I'm just going to go ahead and cancel that for now. Stop sharing. Oh, and look at that. Even Richard Hart's, so I'm looking at the Telegram over here, and, and Richard Hart even posted in the Telegram. Oh, yeah, and that Pulse Chain main chat is popping off. So cool. For those also that don't know, the Pulse Chain Telegram room used to be a place where at any given time you could go 24-7, 365. There'd be 50 people, 100 people there. And right now I'm looking at this chat and there's 86 people in there. Let's see what we got going on. Oh, that's so crazy. That That's really cool. Hey, what's up, everybody? What's up, Hexy Chef? Good to see you. So this live stream wasn't necessarily meant to be super long. I just wanted to make the announcement. I wanted to show everybody how to connect. And let me show you. Oh, what's up, Aventus? Yes, sir. V3 is live. Let me go ahead and show you guys PulseX as well. So again, going back to Richard's tweet, you could see app dot pulse x right here and what you can do is you can trade your testnet tokens and that's a whole other evolution in this whole thing now there are still some looks like some things that aren't what's the pulse x price really is that low i wonder well let's let's check some stuff oh we got hex very nice very good um let's go to the how do you do it here? Info? Is it info? Yeah, there we go. So if you navigate to info, you can see the different pools and tokens. Let's check to see if internet money. Oops, like it did. Yeah, so for those who have our participants in the internet money ecosystem you'll know that we've had this plan backup plan depending on how internet money gets snapshotted and treated here on the pulse chain pulse x fork and i don't see it here so this lends credence to why the backup plan is very very important Let's see if we got any top pools Okay, it doesn't look like volume is propagating right now. Okay, we're seeing some action. That's cool. Oh, top pool, hex, wrap pulse, hexedron. Very cool. Still nothing on the incentive token, so we'll see what's going on there. Oh, this is cool. I got the yeah. So none of the uh, looks like none of the pricing or metrics are aggregating right now. So this does kind of still look like a base layer of the test net. So we're probably still going to see some building on this and some more. Well, we're going to have to see some more because this this isn't everything right now. Okay. Well, 
I can't connect my wallet because that's going to obviously expose some things. But let me stop the screen here. Let me check on a snapshot real quick. So if you want to check your copies on Pulse Chain Testnet, what you would do is whatever wallet you are holding your ERC-20s in, Hex, Link, Internet Money, whatever it was, you will just connect to Pulse Chain Testnet V3 and then import the, the contract address just like you would on Ethereum. The contract address is exactly the same on Pulse Chain as it is on Ethereum. So let me see if I can see something in mine. Hexy Chef IM is not on te on V3. So I'm wondering how long ago this snapshot was taken. So the snapshot was probably taken a few months ago. Hello, just have a question, please. Why price showing three time double? I'm not sure what that means. I can't answer that, but hello, good to see you. Oh, yeah, okay. So this, interesting. So this was, yeah, I don't even know when exactly this was taken. This was taken taken a while ago I don't I wonder if we'll get when the snapshot was taken let me see if I can get that figured out real quick What is the total supply of PLSX? I believe, and don't quote me on this exactly, but I believe it is about 17 trillion ish. Could be a little more, could be a little less, but. Interesting. If you enter your address on the block explorer, it shows a date and time. It could be snap time. Mine was 318. No, maybe. How do we get the contract address for USDT or DAI on V3? Is it the same as ERC20? Yes, MedJ. The contract addresses for the fork are exactly the same as they are on Ethereum. So just go over to Ethereum, Etherscan, get those contract addresses, and that's the legit, the legit one. And apologies for the brief moments of silence. I'm, I'm researching things as we speak. Hmm. Oh, yeah. You also, I'm going to share my screen real quick as well, because if you're importing a token, you may also get these errors. So let me show you how to overcome those as well. So you see what I did here? So I import, so this is the hex contract address here that I pulled directly from Etherscan. And but you get this error that says this address matches a known Ethereum mainnet token address. 
recheck the contract address and network for the token you are trying to add. So what you have to do in this case is you have to physically type in the token symbol and type in the token decimal. That is, that is something that happened with V2B as well. So just you can get that information from the block explorer. So by that I mean, so let's say I go to Ethereum block explorer and I paste the hex contract address. You can, where exactly is it under info? Where does it show this guy? Well, you know the t the ticker symbol is that obviously, but where does it show the decimals? Ah, here it is. Okay, so where it says other info over here to the right, token contract with eight decimals. So back on MetaMask, where it says. Token symbol, token decimals, for hex, you would put eight. And that's just, it's different for every ERC-20. So don't assume that it's eight. Do what I just did, and you can find it there. So let's see if that worked. Yep. Oh, yeah, that pulse chain main chat is blowing up. Let's peep in and listen real quick. Interesting. Well, let's see. Yeah, I, th I think that's really it. Oh, I see. I see another question. Sorry, please. I want to know when I sell, showing me price to less. Who's a not? I'm sorry. I don't know how to answer that question. I'm. When you sell, what and where are you trying to swap something on Pulse X Testnet? Daydreamer, is there no limit orders on V3? I, there does not appear to be at this time. So we're going to have to wait and find out if that change is going into mainnet. All right. Well, I just wanted to make a quick, short live stream. Again, showing you how to connect, answering any questions. Appreciate everybody for jumping in. As always, you can reach out to us on Telegram. The Pulse Chain Telegram is popping right now, so there's going to be people in there for a while answering any live chat questions. If you want, if you want a little more one-on-one, -on -one, you can join our Telegram at Internet Money IO. Go to the website InternetMoney.io. It's right here in my name, and let's continue to learn and grow together. All right, everybody. Hope you have a good day. Looking forward to that Pulse Chain mainnet. Peace.